Text wrapping in Google Sheets or Excel is useful because it ensures that long pieces of text fit neatly inside cells, making them visible and preventing them from overflowing into other cells. Here I have three lines of text in three rows. Right now, all three overflow through two columns. The default option for all text is the overflow option. To change that, you go to the formatting toolbar and select the text wrapping icon. The first one on the left is overflow, which means the text flows through all space unless there is data in the columns next to it. If I select the clip option, which is the one on the far right, the text gets clipped at the end of the column. It won't spill over to another column, even if the column is empty. The clip option is great for URL addresses, as they are often very long, but you don't need to see the whole text. Finally, the middle option is to wrap text. This option is used very often when you need more space in your row or column, so you will wrap the text to fit the cell. It doesn't spill over empty columns, but adjust the size of the cell to fit it. You can see row 7's height has increased to fit the text. In our personal budget, if we narrow down the expense description column, some of the text will be cut off. By default, the text overflows, but there is data in the next column, so you don't see it. If I wrap it, the row's height increases to fit the text. If I clip it, it will look like the overflow option. You can't tell the difference because there is data in the next column, but if that column was empty, you would see no text with the clip option, but would see the text spilling over with the default overflow one. Thanks so much for watching.